back to my channel and for today's vlog, I'll be sharing with you the travel requirements and some tips during our trip to Thailand. Okay, so for this trip, first time namin doon sa New Clark International Airport kasi natatry ko pa lang doon sa pinakaluma nilang Clark International Airport or either sa Naiya. So if you're planning to take SETEX, doon kayo sa North Clark exit compared doon sa South kasi mas malapit yung North doon sa International Airport. So our departure time was at 7.15pm. The usual kapag international flight, dapat at least 4 hours na sa airport ka na. Then upon arrival sa airport, we head straight to pay the travel tax. Kapag magbabayad kayo na travel tax sa airport, make sure na hindi nyo pa na siya nababayaran when you purchase your flight ticket. For example, sa Cebu Pacific, kapag bibili ka ng flight ticket, sa dulo ng purchasing mo, tatanungin ka muna ng site if gusto mo nang bayaran yung travel tax, which is 1,620 pesos. I'm not that sure if merong fee kapag sa Cebu Pacific site ka magbabayad. In our case, hindi ko muna siya binayaran online kasi I prefer na bayaran siya personally. Sa mga first timers na pupunta doon sa Clark International Airport, yung travel tax nila lahat nasa left side. So, iisang counter lang siya na allotted for travel tax. Pag nakita mo yung Blue Smith Cafe, sa katabi lang nun, dun yung travel tax mismo. So, pagdating nyo doon sa travel tax counter, tatanungin muna kayo ng staff if galing ba kayo sa check-in or nabayaran nyo na ba yung travel tax online. So, i-make sure naman nila na hindi madodoble yung mababayaran nyo. After you pay for the travel tax, hanapin mo na yung section ng airline mo for baggage drop. Unfortunately, sa Clark International Airport, walang baggage drop na naka-allot. Hindi ko lang sure kung nung time lang na yon Pero nung pumunta kami, iisa lang yung pila doon sa mga nakapag-online check-in na and sa mga hindi pa. So, medyo naging useless yung pag-online check-in ko a week before kasi iisa lang naman pala yung pila para sa lahat. So, when we reached the check-in counter, buti na lang nag-print out na ako ng mga booking confirmation ng hotel namin para binigay ko na lang siya agad doon sa staff kasi nga kailangan nila yon para i-fill out yung details namin for check-in. Then, after that, we went straight to the immigration. So, yung immigration sa Clark International Airport, hindi mo na kailangan mag-fill out ng departure card. And wala ka rin mahanap doon na area na makakahingi ka ng departure card. Kasi they will be requiring you to present your QR code from the etravel.gov.in. For 3 days, including the departure date, dapat doon mo palang pinifill out yung e-travel.gov. For example, when the departure day mo, dapat Monday mo palang siya gagawin or Tuesday or sa mismong day ng flight mo. So for faster transactions, sinabihan na kami ng staff sa pila palang na i-prepare lahat ng documents. So, yung mga requirements na pin-repair ko, COE, syempre mahihingi mo yun sa company. Tapos, printed out na booking confirmation ng hotel namin. Tapos, mga flight tickets. Tapos, syempre yung passport. And sa mga nagtanong from my previous vlog, hindi po kami bumili ng travel insurance for this trip as well. So, nung turn na namin pumunta sa I.O., we went there as a group. Pagdating namin sa I.O., pinrasan ko na lahat yung mga papeles and yung pinakauna bumungad sa kanila yung COP. So, yung first question nila agad sa akin, saan ako nag-work, ano yung work ko, and about saan yung company ko. Tapos, in din sa akin, kailan kami babalik. Tapos, ayun na, pinicture na na ako and sinap na yung passport ko. So, after sa akin, hinanap naman yung sister ko. Ang tinanong lang naman sa kanya kung student ba siya or nag-work na. Tapos, yung brother ko rin, ayun lang din yung tinanong. The same as with my mom, kung ano yung occupation niya. Tinataka na yung passports nila. Then, picture taking. Tapos, ayun na, pinalipas na kami. Then, after namin kumain, pumunta na kami diretso doon sa boarding area to wait for our boarding time. Hypnotized, I don't know why she got me feeling this way. She's got me. Yeah, she doesn't know that she's got a hole. She's got that certain kind of gravity. Finally arrived here in Bangkok. It's already 11 p.m. Manila time. So, dito one or behind sala. So, mga 10 p.m. then sa kanila. So once you arrive at the airport, kailangan nyo munang puntahan yung immigration. So yung immigration nila medyo malayo siya doon sa gate kung saan kayo binaba. Parang yung 
marker ko is dalawang duty-free left side bago nyo marating yung immigration. Basta after nyo makalabas sa airplane, sundan nyo na lang syempre yung mga kasabayan nyo sa aeroplano. So, during our trip, medyo matagal nga lang yung pila ng immigration sa Suvarnabumi Airport. Siguro nagti kami mga 30 to 1 hour yung hintay namin doon sa pila. After the immigration, we went straight to the assigned carousel for our baggages. Then after that, kinlame ko na yung SIM. So when you book the SIM sa cloak, i-ask ka muna kung anong counter mo siya pipick up in. So you have two choices if sa Bernabumi Airport kayo. First is, kung sa cloak counter ba nila, mas okay yon if bumili rin kayo ng rabbit or ng BTS card for the transportation kasi doon nyo rin siya pipick up in. Pero in our case, yung SIM lang yung binili namin. So I preferred na i-pick up in siya sa DTA counter. our cash. So, yung dala ko is peso, then yung mom ko is dollars. So, pagkababa nyo sa escalator, hindi nyo kagad makikita yung super rich and yung happy rich. So, ang kailangan nyo gawin, pumunta pa kayo doon sa left side para may another escalator pa tapos doon nyo makikita yung super rich and happy rich. And if you're planning to ride the train, doon lang din siya sa basement kung saan ka nagpapapalit ng pera. But if you do not like to ride the train to go to the city, kami nagbuka kami ng grab. Per floor, may naka-allot siyang transportation. Sa basement, doon yung train. Tapos may floor din for taxi. Tapos yung floor kung saan yung arrival, doon kayo pwedeng mag-book ng grab. Hypnotized, I don't know why She got me feeling this way She's got a way about her She's got a way about her My mesmerized like every night By every word she'll say She's got a way about her She's got a way about her Yeah, she doesn't know That she's got a if you want to see more of me or more of this kind of vlog, do not forget to click like, comment, share, and subscribe. I'll see you in my next one. Bye!